Hello everyone, this is Don Rush, and we're back with our Manchurian Candidate series. And, yeah, sorry for the short episode last time, but, yeah, as you saw, I crash. So, we only had a few more minutes left anyways. But, uh, we're at war with Manchu, we're winning, obviously, and our vassals are taking everything. So. I wonder... Is that curiosity? It would take... 243% to take all of their provinces. That seems kind of high. Especially since it's basically just here in bits and pieces. Eh, whatever, I guess. Alright. So, our maintenance is low because we're up here just waiting. We're letting our vassals do everything. It's a waiting game. Actually, I wonder where it picked off. I'll think about it. I don't know what year it was. Eh, whatever, we're fine. Boating? Why are we sieging it? Oh, it's being sieged, I see. I mean, it's not really being seized, but whatever. Poor Ming and their super low. I wonder, can we vassalize them? I doubt it. Like I said, if, yeah. Full annexation, 175%, and yeah. Vassal would be 233. I guess they are pretty big. Shun? Ooh, that'd be nice. Except for, you know, I have cores over here, I'm pretty sure. Um, no. I don't have cores over here. Where are my cores? Is this the only core? Yeah, seems to be. And return cores. That one and that one? No, I want my cores, you scumbags. Alright, whatever. I guess urine is the one that we, we need to smash. I really hope they never become a vassal under Oriat, or we're screwed. Oriat declared war on Yorkland. Well, who's their allies? Hopefully this is a big war. Um, no guy and Ladakh. No guy, not gonna help him, and Ladakh. Oh, I don't even know where that is. Oh, right here. Yeah, that's not gonna help. Goodbye, Oria is eating you. But, uh, they hold problems that are likely ours. Oh, because the, the, actually, I'm not entirely, oh, they took, they integrated, ah, oh, well, there we go. Yeah, they have a lot that belongs to us. Scumbags. Pure scum. But, let's pay some loans. Play all the loans, actually. I don't know why we had so much money. We're just making a lot now. Kara no longer has their peasants war. Good for them. Uh, managed to overpower their oppressors. France has peasants war. Interesting. Yeah, they took this back. Or Shiva. They'll just take it back, though. France has peasants war. Trade crisis. Our merchants report that they are facing stiffening resistance to try to peddle their wares. They are talking like it is the end of the world and fear that they will never earn a copper again in life. Okay, yeah, I have the Diplo power, I guess. I'll take a little bit of a loss on it, a Diplo point, to, to save some money in the long run. So Briatia is now allied with Korea. Huh? The problem is, we can't get over here. Unless we get boats. And coming from here to there is really going to be annoying. But... Maybe Shiba would called into multiple wars. Are they in this war? No, I was gonna say what the hell. They're not even in the war. What the hell? Oh, they just don't want to be in both of these at the same time. All right, whatever. Russia has announced the Orient as a new rival. Didn't realize they hadn't. So now you want to be friends? Nope. Because we don't have much for power. And the distance. Eh. It's kind of annoying, but oh well. It happens. Guess we can improve relations with them for a little bit. Uh, who else do we want? Uh, are they being eaten? They are definitely being eaten. Uh... Increase it with the Timurids. 
Why not? We're sitting here waiting for our vassals to do all the work anyways. Getting some map power back. Man, we're almost at full. Son of a bitch. I mean, I guess we could make men, but man, we should have way more freaking manpower capped than 14,000. Oh, well. Here we go. Nice chunk. Guess we're going to build some down here. So be it. This is a bit will allow us to uh, at least fight off Korea when we just dis decide to fight Baratia. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, they are a rival. All right. Peace offered by man. Guess what? That's not enough. Your entire country is, quote unquote, going to collapse. Not that it hasn't already. I mean, do you see this nonsense? Because I see this nonsense, and that's nonsense. We have Rebel Uprising, Gone Patriots. Is that just from controls? Convert Manchu to Buddhism. Nope. Defect the urine. Gone. Is that like a culture? Probably, I'd assume. Um. Gone. Alright. Ah! I guess I'm confused again. Oh, uh, they want to pop up here and try to take that back? Well, yeah, it's not even core. What do you think? Scum. Pure scum. But, prove relations with our vessel for now, then. I mean, we give them so much stuff. Can't imagine them having a problem. Could build a couple armories. Not gonna do us much. I think I'd rather have an army. Uh, Emperor, we have lost a claim on something over here. Because we can't I have no diplomats. Why are you entering a coalition versus? We didn't even do anything. We lost claims, and you're like, oh, how dare he? God damn it. Hmm. Well, could always use more admin points as well as technology for military. Probably admin points is what we want. So, Timurids, alliance? Still no. Well, damn you guys. Damn you to hell. Uh, I guess we'll increase with uh, Mayao. Or however you pronounce it. Because I would like them to have a vassal again. Yes, again. Which seems a bit on the crazy side, but whatever. Yeah, Ming, oh my god, that negative three stability, almost 13 war exhaustion. Oh, you poor, poor things. I'll take the inflation for admin points, sure. No problem. Hmm. Peace offer from Ming. We'll cede to Manchu. Ming will renounce their claims on all of this. Holy crap, like everything. Cost me 400 diplo points. Decline. How about we hold off for a minute? Because <laughs> that seems like it might be a bad idea. But I do want their whole place to just crumble. The whole thing just crumble. You're in. Please uh, stop being friends with the Oriat. Interesting. Baratia and you're in. So what I could do is declare war on Baratia. And have Korea as a co-belligerent. And then they'll call in Urin. And I could fight them. Ho ho! I found my inn. Gain some land from the scum that is Urin. And, well, take back my land. It's my land! It's not your land, it's my land. Call for peace, eh? Alright, well. Let's take back this diplomat and... We will talk to them. Actually, is that a core of mine? No, it's not. So, I don't care. Got some claims here, though. Claim here, that's it. That one, and this is a core. What this? Nothing of mine. Hmm. This belongs to Zhao. 
this should. I don't know why I don't. Interesting. Well. They do have one here, so I'll give this one to them. Let's see. Oh, God damn, how many times I gotta do that? Transfer Occupy, there we go. Transfer, I could. But I don't know if I will. Hmm. Alright, and the rest, I wanna make sure I get my cores back. That's core. I have a claim here. That one. Then maybe like release nations or something. Revoke their core on on Dong. Mongolia. Zhao, Zhao, you're in Zhao. Nothing about me, huh? Wow, they have cores all over the place. And none of them belong to me. Ah, they do have this one. I'm not sure I care about returning cores. Wait. Revoking cores, not returning. Hmm. Alright, well. Release Chun? That would be the worst idea. Probably be a decent ally. And then I want all your money. War reparations. Did I mention yes, all of your money? Well, most of it. Sounds good to me. Yes. Make sure I don't need any more land for Ming to get uh, the ability to create Ching. I need Zolangol, Xunyang, and that piece. And that's all here, yeah? Shenyang, and Olangol. Zingol or Olan? Zingol, alright, so I need this stuff. Alright, fine. That, so be it. Let's, let's do it, we're good. Wait, what happened? Um, alright, well, so be it. That one, that one, that one. Release. And all your money. I'm forgetting something. This? I guess I wanted to give them that, but... Why? Oh, oh, I know why. And there we go. War reparations. That's what it was. And then one, two, three. That's good. That's what I want. Send. Noise. What tech group are they? They are six. Well, they're going to get eaten alive. Can we declare war on them? We can just immediately declare war again. Ming is no longer a rival. Well, go figure. Or our marriage? Uh, sure, why not accept? Too few rivals. Commer, Oriat. Well, let's see. What are their choices? I thought I wasn't. They weren't a. De oh, whatever. Shun. We are declaring war on you in one day. Wait. No Cassus Belly. Well, okay. After we fabricate this one claim, I'm probably going to feed you back to Mongolia or something. I think that might work. So they have whoop patriots, why? I mean, they seemed fine a minute ago. We have gained back our cores, I believe. Yep. And what did we want to do? We have a lot of money, which is crazy, but awesome. So one and... The rest will be Eastern Archers. Could use another nine. Well, if we had any manpower, what was I thinking? It's not the money that's the problem, it's the fact that we have no manpower. 
Is we can make some armories. Oh wait, we already have max armories. Kinda sorta. Eight, eight, eight. There we go. That'll help out. Should at least. Uh unrest. Do we have any core oh yeah, that one. Deming. Oh yes, yeah, this one. We will start carring that one. This one, on the other hand, we are going to sell. We are going to sell. We should sell this. But to who? Yeah, we'll sell it to them. Maybe they'd like it. Sell province. Oh, we have no diplomat. Well, we'll take you back, and then we'll send it. Actually, give us trade power. That'd be kind of cool. And a loan offer, send, give, give subsidy. Sell profit. There we go. This one. Sure, you want it. No. Why? Not except culture gone. But don't you have like a thing on it? Ming, Manchu, and Urine. Well, wait. Does that say a core? A core. You consider it a core. Well, that's weird. That's not what I wanted. I wanted to sell. Sell province. This one. This guy's going to be way too big. Alright, well. You are the mega vassal. Could we even if we wanted to? Da 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 da. Cannot send another diplomat. It will cost us 1650. Well, that, he's too big. I don't think we can get that many points. We could. We could actually, if we max it out, we could. So no longer should we feed them. Uh, Gate province in peace. Regards of expansion, not a big deal. Improve relations. Here. Because, again, I would love to have a... Uh, Match for this so we could become vassal again. Hmm. Still building, we are. Come on, everybody, go here. This way we can declare war. Maybe we should wait for manpower to replenish at least a little bit. Would they be. Who, who's willing? No diplomat. Well, after this. And after that. And. Oh, Ming is being eaten. So this might get taken away. How did they lose Wu? Well, maybe our vassal is about to get eaten alive. By freaking scum Wu. Wu Patriot, that is. wonder if they're a, a place that could actually exist. Could make some more stuff, but we'll hold off. Let it fall or 10 army tradition. Well, let it fall. It's only 10 years. Not a big deal. Hmm. Shun has announced Ming as her new rival. Well, go figure. Take whatchamacallit. We'll give this to Mongolia, I guess. Like, all of it. Declare war. Why Why do we have a truce? Okay. Because we released them or something. Alright, whatever. So, how would this war be accepted? It wouldn't. Uh, distance and in debt. Hmm. So, if we called it against Korea, we'd have to make you in a co-belligerent. Declare war. Everybody would come in, though. And if we could make, made them a co-belligerent, they'd call them in. We could make Briatia a co-belligerent, and it'd be the same thing, only people would help us in the Korean War. And they're only allied with... yeah. Alright, we could do it that way. That's all we'll do. Make sure we have all of our claims. We don't, so we have a lot to fabricate before we do this. Which is kind of lame, but oh well. It happens. It'll let... Zhou or Zhao or whatever you want to call them kind of gather the troops together to fight off this massive rebellion. 
because screw this area and it's nonsense but whatever I'd love to help oh where do they keep pulling men out of their ass from but I don't know if they can crush out what 64 more units might they might have to suffer for it um fabrication recall I mean, if we could just vassalize them, that'd work too. Could we send them some money? I don't know if we have that kind of money. Send a gift. Basically could. Yeah. 25 for a vassal is worth it. Uh, production research flawed. That's not good. I'll lose some prestige, because I ain't got none anyways. How would you like to become our vassal for the second time? Ta-da! Great. Yeah. That works. I was thinking, well, now that they'd help us out, maybe we could just call them in. But I don't think that's true. Do we have any culture conversion we can do? Indeed not. We're way over our cap for boats. Do we have anything besides... Because we don't have any freaking coastal basically anymore which is annoying wait yeah we're 25 and 22 so that's probably costing us some nice cash could we sell you some boats mate no okay no 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 nope why not Why does nobody buy boats? I've still yet to even see that option. I mean, we are about to go to war. It's pulling in cash. Maybe we should just deal with it for now, because we're going to take a bunch of stuff back from urine. All of our cores, preferably. Man, I would love to make them a co-belligerent, but then they'd call in the Oriat, and I can't handle that. Uh, annoying. Maybe if Russia wanted in. Actually, they're not that far off. That's the same religion and neutral. We could get rid of that. We could increase our army strength. No, it just would never happen. Because we don't have the the, the area. And they, this is not the same religion. It's just... Uh, they say no because distance. Well, shoot, who am I supposed to ally myself with? The Oriat is way too powerful nowadays. I have to basically wait for Russia to attack them and then deal with it. Alright, whatever. Guess we could, uh... Hmm. Manchu Alphabet. Okay. Nomad group, increased over time. We don't have anything else to really spend it on, so why not? I mean, I guess we could do it in the next war, but... Eh, maybe that increased it? Probably not. No, nah, it didn't. I had hope. It was just, you know, blind hope, but it was hope. Fourteen. All will accept. That is a little bit of increase compared to elsewhere, that is. Oh, man. We can do it again. How about a four or five? We got a couple fives. Sure, why not? That's not where I intended to build that, but I accept regardless. So they are at 13. Urine is at 10. Ha! Wouldn't be a problem. Korea is at 11. Briathia is at 10. Yeah. Zhao is 11. Mongolia is 10. Eh. Oh, well. It is what it is. Hmm. And of course, uh, Mao is at 13, which is quite amazing for me. And contiguous borders, because all my vassals would just share. So they'd be able to move all the way they went. Gan Patriots, eh? Please don't go. Ah, I don't have that land. Never mind. Not relevant. Uh, how you doing, mate? 
Uh, you have one stability, negative prestige as well. Oh well, it happens, man. All right, we'll end the episode here. When we come back, we'll probably declare we're on Baratia. Make Korea cold belligerent and have Colin urine. That's what I'll do. Nope, Korea and Colin them too. That's what the plan is. Please don't gain any more allies. A coalition versus Manchu. That is something I didn't think about. They're both in a coalition, so I wouldn't be able to call them as cold belligerent, could I? Nope. God damn it. But I could call war on anybody and they'd come in. So maybe I could just take the Shun thing. And then they'd come in. Interesting. That might be an idea. I'd only have to wait two more years. Eh. For manpower, it might be worth it. But until then, uh, if you guys like the episode, please hit the like button. Help out a ton. And I will see you guys next time. All right. Goodbye.